all right guys i'm playing um war robots on the iphone 14 pro max uh using the backbone as a game controller and i'm recording this for iphone 12 in the back uh, in the background is my radar ge 67 hx gaming laptop right this is my second hanger uh we've got erebus erebus has got uh, three prismas uh one is a stellar prisma that's uh level three the prismas uh, both of them are level six it's good there's this good guy drone uh, he cannot shoot or do anything like that, but, um, right, three army kits. Let's just see what he does, because I, I am talking about drones. Not in great detail. Um, the, when the robot's durability falls below 30%, activates Aegis. Aegis is like a shield, you know? This uh, Erebus already has a shield. I mean, an energy shield. Uh, this Erebus is level 10. This is Cryptic Fenrir, and he's uh, level 9. Uh, this drone, I think it just provides some um, defensive, you know, f uh, f after you take a picket. I'll read it for you guys. This is Shatter. It's got Shatter, level 1. Lemming, level 1. That's uh, that e electrical, that new weapon. Avalanche, level 7. And this is like uh, a rocket launcher. Shatter is a slow down weapon. Modules, it's got a heavy armor kit, level 1. That's for armor. Nuclear amplifier, damage output, and a nitro unit. That's for speed. Right, let me just see what this drone does. Right, it says on low durability. It says when the robot's durability falls below 35%, increases the power of the robot's defense system. Okay, that's not too bad. Right, um, so this is... Um, and that's a level 9. Right, this is an OPN level 9. It's got two ivory scrooge level 7, those energy weapons. Sinister Pulsar is a lockdown weapon. It's got a balance unit, level 1, and two armor kits. Let me see what this drone does. Because uh, I don't know all of the drones. Uh, this is called Defender. Uh, the drone ability, if the robot receives over 70,000 damage within 5 seconds, activates Ansel. Right, so that's like an energy shield. Activates an energy shield. <clears throat> this is a gift bringer, Fafnir. This one was a crypt uh, cryptic Fenrir, they're not the same. Uh, this one has the same uh, thing. I think it's the same drone as this dude had, right? Same drone. And something about your. Um, I'll read it again. Uh, it's got two scuddies. One's a level four. That's level three. Uh, those are like freeze weapons. Uh, it's got an avalanche, uh, avalanche. That's a rocket launcher. Modules. It's got a heavy armor kit. That's for armor or durability. Nuclear amplifiers for damage output. It's got a nitro unit. That's for speed. Um, this. Oh, yeah. Sorry, I didn't read about the drone. I keep forgetting what these drones do. This drone is called Sidekick. When the robot's durability falls below 35%, increases the power of the robot's defense system. So, I don't know if uh, this Fafnir has an energy shield. I think it's more physical shield. But anyway. Um, the crew. Right, the, this is a cruel angler level seven. You got uh, you got two blaze blazes. This is a, a flame thrust, but one's a dragon blaze or the flame thrust. Uh, the she fang. This is like that lightning thing, but it's the light version. This is a stellar hornet level eight. That's dot damage weapon. That means you, the robot takes damage over time. It's got a nuclear amplifier nitro unit. That's for speed and a nuclear amplifier is uh, for damage output. The drone is a starter drone. It says if the robot receives more than 70,000 damage within five seconds, repairs a portion of its durability immediately. Right, so if you start receiving damage, this um, drone will <coughs> recover your uh, durability, starts healing you basically. Uh, this is Oxmus level 67, and uh, no, um, no pilot on this one. It's got two lanterns, level 10. A cinder that's for fire, like I said, that's level 15. Modules, two, three onslaught reactors. One's level 16, 15, and 8. Uh, that's for um, damage output, basically. Titan Anticola is level 8. That's if someone's trying to freeze the robot. The, I mean the Titan, then those effects will be slightly less. Anger 3. Right, this is a Crimson Hawk. It's got a wasp. Wasp, uh, like I said before, uh, fires uh, on its own. It can shoot on its own. It's a, it's a drone that can shoot, defend your robot. Right, uh, it's got two sneers. 
level 4 and level 8 that's a freeze weapon Termok hell uh, these are the same as those but these are the heavy weapons those also freeze and this crimson oak is a level 8 uh, sorry level 9 it's got three armor kits right the next one is a hawk uh, it's not a crimson hawk it's a basic hawk it's also got a wasp but this wasp is wasp is a level six you know i'm wondering if these if these mean anything okay so i know that this shoots on its own it says the drone increases the output damage of the robots the effect is active all the time so your output damage is like increased and uh, the first thing it does says the drone can he uh, deal high damage at long range the drone fires independently of the robot like i said before that drone can shoot on its own right but this drone is level six i'm wondering if okay it hasn't gone i don't know what level you have to get to this one it says acid sprayer uh so okay so it is a level six right uh this uh hawk is level nine it's got the wasp you already heard what that does it increases the damage output of your robot plus it also can shoot on its own at long range so it will attack a titan or a robot that's near you uh, it's got two magnetos level five those are lockdown weapons that means uh like like the word says lockdown you know it means when you shoot a titan or a robot enough times you know like you keep hitting it uh the effect uh takes uh hold then the robot can move or the titan can move that's what lockdown means uh it's got two prisoners one's a level seven level one those are laser weapons they deal damage at 1100 meters it's just that they're not stellar they're not the golden type they're the original uh it's got three armor kits this is a fafnir level nine and it's got a scuddy no four scuddies uh one scuddy is level four one uh, the other scuddy is level three the other two scuddies are level two those are freeze weapons but these do automatically target uh robots or titans that's why i like these uh, it's got a balance unit level two what that means is that all your weapons working together have higher damage output i can just read it to you guys i think if i read it, it'd be better it says increases both the durability and the damage uh of the robot you see so the damage output is increased and your durability durability so your armor is uh, increased nuclear amplifier let's read what this does uh, it says for every 25 thousand damage inflicted on the enemy your robot receives a small damage boost for the entire battle upon reaching the maximum possible mm. so twenty-five thousand damage receives a small damage up uh, boost for the entire battle that's interesting so if, if you keep causing damage to the robot or the titan you're just getting a damage boost so that's like honor points isn't it I'm just thinking about it. Armor kit. Let's see what armor kit. We already know what it is, but it says basic armor plating increases robot durability. Right. Uh, this drone, I don't know the name of it. It's called Kestel. And I think this is the death mark one. For, it says each drone weapon hit uh, applies a death mark effect to the target, increasing the damage dealt to it. The more it hits on the target, the stronger the effect. So it just puts a death mark on whoever you're targeting or like uh, for example uh, a titan so it just puts a mark on it if everyone starts going towards that robot to attack it you start getting like a damage boost you know so you start getting more honor points this is a level nine as well next is invader level seven it's got a fainter that's a lockdown weapon experimental lock uh experimental spark right i've always wanted to know what these do i know the energy weapons light energy system that ele electrocutes enemies with electric charge damage increases as the distance decreases evaporates targets at close range in uh, no time okay so you have to be close this is a electrical weapon so this is like the the like that weapon i was talking about the new ones so these, these spark are the same as that one fainter i already told you it's a lockdown thing this is level seven this one is the eye uh, it's a level four so i read what the first thing is the large ammo and high rate of uh, fire allow the drone to lay down suppression fire the drone fires independently of the robot right so this got a target seeking minigun so it can shoot on its own basically and then it says the second ability is this drone increases the output 
uh, damage of the robot, the effect is active all the time. So not only does it shoot on itself, it also helps your robot, um, you know, like have more damage output. So that's quite good. So it's got two armor kits. Right, uh, this one is a Crimson Hawk, level 10. Got uh, Composite Spark. Uh, those are like energy weapons and Viper, like I said. Two Vipers. Uh, okay, the Composite Spark is uh, both, is, one is level 9, the other is level 7. A Viper is... Um, one is level four, the other is level three. It's got three armor kits. Uh, this one, Doltoki, that's a laser uh, thing, laser uh, drone. It says the drone fires a laser that does not require reloading. The weapon damage is re reduced by up to 75% when firing continuously for an extended period. The drone fires uh, with the robot at uh, opponents in its aim so let's see what's this uh the weapons damage is reduced by up to 75 percent when firing continuously for an extended period uh, reduced by some... okay so i think it decreases with time so if it keeps shooting at at where whoever it's shooting at it just decreases in uh in time you know like the the the, the damage output is decreased right this is just an electrocution weapon Let's go to the, the Titan. It's a Hemidal level 10, no Titan uh, pilot. It's got two crates. Uh, those are dot damage weapons. And then Cinder is uh, fire. Lantern is a blinding weapon. Modules, uh, it's got sinister reactor damage output. It's got three Titan uh, armor kits. Those are level ones. So it's not exactly the best, but it is what it is. Right. I think this is level three. 